Hare Krishna, obeisance. Um, I'm going to try to be brief because I don't think of myself as a good speaker. Um, uh, I encountered this practice through books, and then uh, as I look back in my life, I've had elements of um, his products, uh, the foot bath and some other things right before I showed up. Uh, I, I, sh I showed up originally at a Rath Yatra, but I couldn't get out of my car because I was in line trying to get through the light that took 10 minutes to get through. Um, my first service was uh, clean dishes. I was just a little scared, like, why should I touch these people's dishes? Um, but that, that started me on um, understanding the point of the practice, at least part of it, that uh, there's nothing, there's nothing like devotional service. Um, you can do a lot of things in your life. Maybe you could become a president of a company, start one. I've been a part of one. Uh, you can have a family, a material family. Um, you can have a lot of things, a lot of possessions, or like gone to great places. But there's nothing like not remembering fully what happened over the weekend, but knowing you were happy the entire time. Uh, like picking up trash, um, being around a live band, uh, people serving prashadam all day, and you're in and out of services here and there. Um, there's nothing, nothing quite like devotional service. And when I first came here, I wanted to understand the practice. And I saw in a book, more than one book, that devotional service is, is the point. And the book couldn't tell me what that meant until I came here. And so... I just want to say that the two, my two wishes are, or our dreams, our hopes, or whatever, is that uh, Maharaj is very uh, um, patient with me when I don't understand something, or I, I um, make mistakes. I'm going to make a lot, and that he always keep me in a service. There's nothing like service. Uh, there's nothing like it. Uh, that's those are my two my two desires that everybody understands that I, I when I got here I gave up everything I could because I thought that's what I needed to do to survive uh, to figure this out I gave up a job before I showed up I took a job nearby to be here every day I'd left that job because it had to deal with cows and and their meat I, I don't associate with most of my family not because I don't want to but because this is the family I, I like more uh, the service here is there's just nothing like it. Once you once you taste something from it, you want to go deeper. And I I, I miss the the festivals. Um, Maharaj can put on a really good festival uh, if you can bring your family. Um, get get everybody engaged for months for some people and days for others. But uh, the one thing I, I I can't say enough about Maharaj is he's been able to give me service. And I hope all of you taste that service and, and will hold on to it as hard as you can. Thank you very much, Maharaj. Thank you very much.